If you answered yes to any of these questions or if you are not sure how you would react in this situation, you are exactly the kind of woman who attracts narcissists. You are the woman who will try to recover from narcissistic abuses and wonder what happened to this wonderful man with whom she fell in love. The narcissist is an empty shell, but they are smart enough to know that they have to cling to someone they can use to be friendly and socially accepted. That's the key. They want someone who seems to have it all on the surface, but with self-esteem, who are dependent on the willingness to change to please the narcissist if you have a relationship with a man who makes you feel uncomfortable or who manipulates you regularly to do things you don't want to do. He is probably not for you. Protecting yourself from a narcissist has a lot to do with the safety of your boundaries and the bad behavior you accept in a relationship. Whether you are a narcissist or not, it is essential to learn to trust your instincts and not to accept bad behavior. No matter how you think of a man, pretending to be interested in hard result issues is part of the manipulation game they are playing. The narcissist also knows that he is attracted to those who, like you, needs him, make him look good. If you want to feel good, dress well, act superior and surround yourself with rich people. On the other hand, he was very interested in the issues of the family of origin he was dealing with and how they had affected me. I would say that narcissists are attracted to everything they are not. I remember being constantly congratulated by my ex for my volunteer work, my appearance, my chosen career and my love of animals. Today, I am a mother who appreciates my role as a mother, wife and housewife. They want a woman to think about them, but they also want someone who can manipulate themes so that's what keeps you from becoming a victim of a narcissist.